so much to Yesta. I literally cannot believe that this this kind of stuff is happening to me. In so many of like my most viewed videos, I would be wearing clothes from Yesta. This cardigan, this sweater, this sweater, this one that I wore in a vlog. 50% of my closet is from Yesta. It's crazy to me that I'm now working with them. You can skip to the next section. There's always a timeline and you can skip this part. This video was sponsored. It means that the clothes were sent to me for free. I didn't pay for them. They reached out to me and wanted to send me these things to review. Although this is a sponsorship, my opinions are honest, which you will see throughout the video. There are things I like, there's things that I didn't like. Regarding the comments about fast fashion, Yestel is fast fashion, as is almost every single brand on the planet. Fast fashion is damaging to the environment and damaging in a lot of other ways. I do want you guys to realize that you're also wearing fast fashion before you like comment things like fast fashion is bad, like yes, we all know, but you're wearing it as well. Some people just don't have that much money to spend on clothing, but they still want to dress nicely, and fast fashion happens to be the only option. And please be nice about how you comment about those things. The overconsumption thing, you're right, this is overconsumption. Buying six hundred dollars worth of clothes is absolutely not normal and should not be normalized. This was sent to me and it was for review purposes to help people make decisions when they buy clothes. When I've shopped for clothes myself, I never buy this much at once, never ever, and I don't consume that much in terms of clothing either. The entire haul was 600 USD. All the clothing items might not add up to that because I did buy makeup items as well, and there will be a part two for that. Welcome. We have five boxes to go through. Yesdal gave me like a budget of 600 USD. I just picked out like whatever. I do remember like one or two pieces specifically, but this was a month ago, so it's like mystery boxes. Oh my god. Makeup. This is also makeup. Why is this so hard to open? I've never had a Christmas where I got like a lot of things at once. This just makes me really happy. I'm glad I get to experience something like this. There we go. I'm gonna sort them into piles so we can open them up in order. This thing, oh my god. Like there's this like whole trend with bows right now and I'm loving it. This quality is actually like really good. I'm surprised. This reminds me of Brandy Melville fabric. I'm really excited about this one. A bit surprised that the color, it is a bit more like salmon than like light pink. It has more of a warm undertone. I'm actually so surprised because the material is good. I've had some experiences with Yestal where the material like really wasn't that good. It's like with Yestal, it's either really good or something's like interesting. This has a star, it's a star tank top. Whoa. The straps are insanely thick. This is like, I've never had a tank top with straps this thick. Material has been really good so far. I don't know why, but it gives me like Biba Doobie vibes. It's not the best like craftsmanship. A lot of their clothes have this problem. Like there's just like loose threads sticking out or like something's not sewn on properly, but that's okay. You can cut them off. The material is very thick. Ooh. This was one of those things on Yestal that had a lot of reviews. And when you, when something has a lot of reviews, it's like you can trust it more. It's the perfect amount of like tight and like stretchy. This is a skirt. There's been so many good reviews under this skirt. It's like it has the perfect length, not too long, not too short. And there's like safety shorts under it. This is pretty short. It's like a bit like wider than I thought it would be. Best skirt I've ever had. Like best skirt I've ever worn. It is like, excuse me, this is so perfect. Exactly like the length I want. Very, very short at the front, but I still feel super safe wearing this because the back is longer. Like, can you see that? It's like, it goes down like this. So I don't feel like insecure about like flashing anyone. And there's like safety shorts under it. I just feel super like safe wearing this. I really wish I had gotten more because this is a really well, well designed. This material is not as good, not my favorite. But again, I kind of, I think it's kind of cute. Did I, I might've gotten a size big because it's like really stretchy and it's like, or maybe it works, I don't know. This is very, very cropped. I actually like this. I've seen this like on so many websites. I, this is my first time having like a tube top. I'm really scared of these things like falling off my body, you know? Like this has like a sticky thing in there. It's like, maybe that helps it stick on. Imagine, imagine walking around and then, and then your shirt just falls off. That sounds like something that would happen to me. It's like that. I, li I actually like the back a lot. And then there's this ribbon in the front. So, so extra. Like, you know, if I wore this out to school, someone would make fun of me, but I don't care because I think it's cute. It just doesn't look that amazing on my body. I love the colors though. It's like really pretty. This is not perfect. It's not as good as I thought it would be. And the print does look really cheap. It's pretty thick. It is pretty thick. I, I thought it would be really thin. Something about the graphic and the print still feels like kind of cheap. I just don't. This like neckline, I really don't like it. Like it's way too high for me. I don't know. I feel like it would look better if like it was just a regular neckline, but it's like kind of higher up. This is so big. I'm, I'm so scared of something being too big for me. Like I really hope nothing's too big. Look, it's pearls. 
I don't like the fit that much. It's like something about it is weird. Like it's like a bit too big in areas. Like kind of dis disproportionate. It just like makes me look really like one dimensional. <laughs> I don't know. I do like the fact that you can you can wear it like this as well. So that's that's cute. It did look really good on the website. I think when you like wear it and like tie it up it's gonna look better this is like so like living in a farm vibe i don't know that i don't that doesn't even make any sense this is so like farm girl living in a cottage in the suburb picking strawberries that's that's the scenario this is such a summer shirt I'm, i really like it tie it up in the back i'm not sure if there's like a ribbon or anything can you see like a bow my friend was looking at my orders today in class and she was like, this kind of looks like a maid outfit and now I don't know how to feel about this shirt anymore. It would look nice with a skirt. I, I'm excited to style this. Oh, there's like ribbons in the sides. This is definitely giving maid costume. Whatever, I'm gonna embrace it. This is one of the most popular items on Yes Style. Okay, nice, really thick material. What does it even say? New school? New... <sighs> I don't get it. This is like super goofy. I don't even know what it says on it. They remind me of like um, the clothes that like babies wear because they're like super easy to button up. I like the fabric. I really like the fabric actually. It's like super thick and it feels really good. What is this? Um, I don't like the lettering. It, it looks nice, but it's just like nonsensical. Like the fit is not at all like giving. <laughs> I look like a preview best boy. It's not good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm sure you guys can totally tell what this is like. This just makes so much sense. It's gonna look like something when I wear it. <laughs> this is so sheer. It feels like nothing. I don't know how to navigate this shirt. It fits really nice. I actually like the design of it and all, but it's a bit difficult to like put on. It's actually really cool. With a tube top and a bolero. I don't think I'm gonna wear this out. It's more like a like wearing at home kind of item. This material feels really cheap, sorry. This is a sponsored video, but I'm still gonna be honest. If there's something I don't like. I will say that. There's a rose on it. This fits so nicely. I am actually so in shock, but it, it actually fits so nicely. I didn't expect it to fit so well. Everything about this is just really well made. Not the best material, but I do really like this design. I don't know, it looks, it's really simple, but I just, I feel like there's so much potential, you know? Oh, you can scrunch it up like by tying it. Interesting. You can tighten it, but you don't need to. I'm disappointed about this one. I'm sorry, but you know what color this was on the website? It was white. You know, the material's all right, but like the ribbon looks so sad. Like, please, please, what is this? You can't even like adjust it and it just looks like goofy. You know what? It's not, it's not that bad. I do not like this. The ribbon, the way it's like sewn on here, it's an okay shirt. Like I'm not, I'm not that mad anymore. It's, it's okay. This is like a really basic piece that I think I would always be wearing. And then like, I, I do like the fact that it does have like lace in there. This is my favorite thing about it. Like the lace at the sleeves. I don't know what it is, but it's so cool. I've never had something like this. It's so, it like really looks nice. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I like it. I like it. I know this is gonna look good. I'm excited. The material is a bit thinner though, like than the other ones. So, but I mean, it is a black shirt, so I don't think it matters as much. I, I can see myself wearing this a lot. I remember the last time I made an, a yes style order myself, I wanted to buy this, but then last minute decided not to get it. And then I regretted it for a really long time. So this shirt is so, so soft. It feels like real cashmere. I know that it's a hundred percent not real cashmere, but it feels like that. I don't like the start, like how it's like super hard. It feels like there's a piece of paper inside this star. I wish it was more like just a regular piece of fabric. This is one of my favorites. It is so, so comfy. It's so soft. The material is really nice. Nice. I see the, I see the vision. I don't like the buttons. I'm sorry. What? Can someone please tell me why the buttons are like this? <laughs> They're like little diamonds, but they look so cheap. The color looks kind of, I'm not sure if it's the lighting, but the color looks a bit green. I don't like the buttons. There's not, there's not even a purpose for them. It is what it is. No, no, stop it. I don't like this kind of material. It feels way too elastic, and like plasticky. I just... I don't know, kind of disappointed because I did really like it when it was on the website. It looks nice though, but it's just, material is not really my favorite. There's supposed to go around your neck, but I just, I don't get it. Like, it's just not, 
It looks really nice, actually. I just feel so cozy in here. No, I don't like this material. It's just too plasticky feeling again. Cardi Monsters. Oh, par Party Monsters, sorry. I'm like, can you see it? It says Party Monster, but with an IE. Hmm, not really my style, but. You know what? This fits really well. Like the vibe, it's not me at all. No, no. This is the worst material of, out of everything. This is terrible. This one is actually terrible. This feels insanely plastic. Oh, it's open back. That's nice. Like it's off the shoulder and there's this like detailing with like a ribbon. So that was the reason I got this in the first place. The thing with this ribbon is that like from close up, you can see the rhinestones, but when you like, it kind of looks more like a ribbon. What I really like about this is that like it is off the shoulder and a lot I have this problem with a lot of off the shoulder tops is that when I like, move my arms like the like off the shoulder thing like it moves back up and it like becomes just like a regular shirt. It doesn't really happen with this one though. I can like move around and it would still like go back. Yeah, this is interesting. This is a really interesting shirt. It's like I've never seen something like this. You won't you won't like it, it won't make sense to you when you're looking at it because it's just it's not gonna make sense when you look at it like this. It has like these sleeves and then like this inside part. I really like this. I thought it was gonna be okay, but I didn't expect it to look really nice. You can like make it go up more like this, be like a v-neck sweater, but I prefer like just having it fall down at the side. It's really unique. I've never seen like a sweater like this. I do not like this. I didn't expect it to be like this. I remember why I ordered it. I thought it'd be like super sheer and like see-through. Because I was thinking, I would want like something really thin for the summer, like a thin cardigan for the summer. This is the first time I've had this problem. Everything else like smelled fine. This this smells really bad. I don't know what, what happened to her. But you know, this has potential. I think you can make outfits with this. That's like, it's a very neutral piece. <laughs> what is, it smells so bad. It smells so bad. I'm sorry, but ew. This thing smells disgusting. And it's the only one. This is a pretty good like sweater though for like transitional weather. Like... Oh my god, I really like it. This is so fluffy. I am so, so in love with off-the-shoulder sweaters right now. Like, I'm actually so in love. It's like an obsession. But this is just so, it's so winter. I don't know how to feel about it. I don't know, it's like, it's a bit weird. I don't, I'm not that into it. Um, what the hell? Um... <laughs> I thought it was gonna have like like a, the lace part inside but it's just the sweater and it's gigantic which is not what I expected I don't understand this I don't understand this sweater at all this could be a dress this could literally be a dress because of how long it is on the website it looked like it was up till here it's still not what it was supposed to be like it is not what I expected at all this is like a monstrosity I don't get it at all I don't get it I don't get it not their best sweater like material. It's okay. I'd say it's okay. This is so grandpa sweater. I'm, I'm gonna wear this with a skirt for sure. It's like that is the that's definitely the vibe. I did see quite some good reviews on it and it looked nice in the picture. Uh, this does feel quite cheap. I'm not gonna lie. Even though it wasn't cheap, like this was not a cheap sweater, but it feels kind of cheap. The star is in leather. This is leather. That's cool. For some reason on the star, it has like lettering, which I don't really like. Hopefully I, I can find a way to cover it up. It's kind of cute. It is really cute, actually. I like it. Okay. I'd like definitely recommend this one. It's, it's very like nice. It's really cute and I just, I like this one. I saw someone wear this in a haul and I really liked how it looked on them. Don't like the fact that they have this thing on there. I just don't really see the point in it. Yeah, I, I, I think I can like undo the stitches and get it off. Then it would be a perfect sweater. It has two zippers. I, I've seen a lot of sweaters that have like two zippers and I just, I don't understand. This is pretty big. It has a lot of stars on it. <laughs> and it's, it is really soft though. It feels cheap. The stars are textured. It's pretty cool. What the hell? The shoulders are so weird. It's it's not what I thought it was gonna be. And I do like the star pattern. Now, final thoughts.
thoughts. I have sorted them into favorites, mediocre, and um, please avoid them, don't get them. I'm just gonna talk about like the worst ones that you should not get. This one is an abomination compared to what it is on the website and it's like completely not what it looks like. If this was in your yesterday card, get rid of it. It's not, it's not worth it. This sweater, just a warning, it smells absolutely terrifying. I haven't had this problem with any of the other ones, but this, I can, I can smell it from here. It's like there's like toxic fumes coming off of it. I, I cannot with that. Sh I don't even know how it, what happened to it. So now about my favorites. First of all, this shirt. I was very surprised because I thought it was going to be a very mediocre shirt, but it actually feels so, so high quality. The material is really, really soft. It fits very nice. It like, it just hugs your body. This set, this pink one, I bought this because like it was pink and I thought it could make like a cute pajama set, but I would actually wear this out because it does look so nice on your body. I was so surprised by how well it fit me. This is like my absolute favorite thing I've gotten in this order. I wish I got this more. This skirt, like it's just, it's so good. Perfect fit, perfect length. I'm so impressed by this. I I wish I got more colors. I might I might go back on Yesel and like buy it in black and white. I had a lot of different skirts in the past. This is the best one in terms of fit, like material, everything. The best one I've ever tried. Thank you so much for supporting my channel as always. It's just, it's such a dream that I get to work with big brands that I've like admired for a long time, that I've been buying from for a long time. It's crazy that I've gotten to the point that those brands have like seen my videos and reached out to me. Thank you guys for supporting me. I wouldn't be able to do these things without you. This is truly one of like the coolest things that has ever happened to me. So thank you all for supporting. Hello, Merry Christmas. Thank you for almost 100,000. I know by the time I post this, it will probably already have gone to 100,000. I can't make the message too long because this video is already super long. I'll make sure to dedicate something special to 100,000 because that's insane. I would have never thought that this would happen to me.